Coming off a big win against the rival Kansas City Chiefs, the Chargers need to continue to play well. And they're going to be taking on a team that's also fighting for the playoffs in the 6-7 and seven Carolina Panthers. As they want to get over the hump, make the wild card in the NFC and potentially do some damage. You know, it's first quarter. Chargers already going for it on fourth down and Mason Conway would run it. Then second and goal at the three. Conway would fake hand it off and he'd run it again. And he would actually get the touchdown as Conway is not a mobile quarterback at all. He's a pocket passer, but he's showing off a little bit of mobility he has there. As now Carolina's offense, Cam Newton would find Kelvin Benjamin. If Benjamin didn't do that spin move, then he could have gotten more yards. As on 4th and 5, the Panthers going for the field goal of Adam Vinatieri, but it's a fake. It's a flip, and Leonard Worrell is there to stop the tight end. He had, the tight end actually had a big game, though. 10 catches for 140 yards. Rowan Murphy is his name, so it's still 7-0. As Conway would look for Rashad Pickney, but Haynes still would intercept it. You can't spell intercepted without the D. So the Carolina Panthers would get it back. As on first down at the 37, Newton would end it off for Christian McCaffrey. Ten carries for a buck. Yards, one dollar in yards exactly at 100. And there are 63 of those rushing yards right there. Making this one all tied up at seven. So Conway would find Alvin Kamara on the screen on third down. And Kamara with a nice play. There he goes down the field to pass the 10-yard line at the 8-yard line. And then second and goal at the 4, beginning of the second quarter, as Conway would look for the end zone where he would find Alvin Kamara. The play was originally not ruled a touchdown, but the Chargers challenged it. And the play was reversed as Cam Newton, after being sacked twice, it is third down and 26 as Newton looking for his target, Murphy. He finds him, but um, he doesn't get enough. So third and inches at the 24 as Conway would find the speedster, Rashad Pickney, who gets the score and the Chargers extend their lead. So Cam Newton on third down, he would find Roman Murphy, the tight end. And Roman Murphy down the field past the 15-yard line. So third and one at the 40. Newton would try to get it. But Marcus Williams and another defender are there reading the play just like reading a book. Not just any book. Since they read it so well, it's probably like some sort of picture book. As Alvin Kamara with a nice run of 15, but he would get hurt. Wayne Coleman would enter the game and Kamara would be out. With an abdominal tear, he's going to be out for the rest of the regular season. And the Chargers would actually sign Jalen Richard um, after the game. As they only had one running back left, which was Coleman. Right there, Richard picking up a nice play. Could have gotten a touchdown, but he ran out of bounds. As on first down, Conway would fumble it. But luckily for the Chargers, Grayson Worthington would recover it. And on third down, when in doubt, just find the speedster Richard Pickney. Who would get the first down? Then on second and inches, Conway would look for his man, his favorite target, Rashad Pickney. Sorry, Mike Williams. He's probably a close second. And Rashad Pickney gets the score. Panthers would go for it on fourth down as Newton would find Kelvin Benjamin, who mosses Jock with Stanley. Great play by Benjamin. Not really keeping the Panthers alive since they're down by so much, but makes it a little closer as Roman Murphy. Gets the touchdown, then the Panthers just hoping for anything is Cam Newton would throw it right in the hands of Jacques with Stanley. He did not like when he got mossed, and he would take this one to the house. Cam Newton's first interception of the game. Reason why I say first is because it's not as only as Cam Newton would be intercepted once again, this time by Tredavious White, and the Chargers would win 38-17.